Energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God, this is your daily devotional reading. This Day with God, a devotional by Ellen White, October 5th, The Great Commandment. God's command to love each other is required of everyone. Showing mercy to one another mirrors his redemptive plan. In compassion he has given of his love that is divine. On the cross sins were forgiven, joy and peace are fully thine. The Great Commandment Master, which is the great commandment in the law? Matthew chapter 22 verse 36 Supreme love for God and unselfish love for one another. These are the two great arms upon which hang all the law and the prophets. A good tree produces good fruit. The evidence of love for Christ is the manifestation of love for one another. Unselfish love for those around us is placed among the brightest evidences of true religion. By it, a daily witness in Christ's favor is born to the world. The appetites and passions must be subdued and controlled, that the nerves may be steady and the brain able to see duty clearly. This can be done through divine grace. The gospel of Christ is the voice of duty and the voice of God. What is meant by a failure to obey, it is seen in the history of Satan, who for his disobedience was cast out of heaven. The greatest talents and the highest gifts that could be bestowed on a creative being were given to Lucifer, the covering cherub. Before his fall, he was a glorious being, occupying a position next to Christ. But he sought to be equal with God and brought upon himself irretrievable ruin. With this lesson before us, let us hide ourselves in Christ. He is the source of all wisdom, all intelligence, all power. Behold, in the cross of Christ, the only guarantee for our salvation. Behold, the Savior giving his life for us, that we might be Christians. Those who strive to live the life of a Christian are battling against the devil's lie. Can we doubt the result of this conflict? God lives, God reigns, and daily he is working his miracles. They that are Christ's have crucified the flesh with the affections and lusts. Galatians chapter 5 verse 24. Before the world and the heavenly universe, they give evidence that they are trying to live out the words, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report. Think on these things. Philippians chapter 4 verse 8. Love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance. These are the fruits of the Christian trees. This day with God, October 5th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.